Hey everyone, Andy here from Alter Live, and I wanted to tackle a question that we get a lot, something that's been sort of a hot button issue for quite a while. Is online church real church? Now, it's definitely a question that's been bringing up a lot of debate and discussion, and it's good to talk about these types of questions, and it's good to start to ask what makes a church really a church. But here's a quick take. Churches are not buildings. They're people. The church is an action. It's, it's not a place. The word church literally means called out people. We've been called out of the world we're living in. We're called to create community and engagement and discipleship out of the grace that we've been shown from Jesus. In fact, he gave us a mission, the Great Commission, which says that we're to go to the ends of the earth, carrying the message of the gospel of Jesus to everyone that we possibly can. We're not called to form buildings of people necessarily, but instead we're called to form communities of people living together for the purpose of learning and growing in the ways of Christ. Now, during biblical times, when most of the Western world was ruled by the Romans, the disciples were able to use technological advancements that had been brought to them, the road. Now, now don't laugh because it actually was very advanced for the time. A cared for road allowed safe passage for people to quickly carry letters, books, money, and really anything else. And the disciples were actually able to start quickly carrying the message of Christ outwards from Jerusalem, using roads to transport letters, books, and ideas to set up pockets of communities wherever they went. Communities of people that were praying for each other, loving each other, sacrificing for each other, and learning about Jesus together. Now, fast forward to today, and we're faced with one of the greatest inventions ever, the internet. Today's road that can be used to spread the gospel may just look like an ethernet cable or a Wi-Fi connection. By using the power of the internet, we're able to carry the message of Jesus to the ends of the earth quicker and more efficiently than at any other time in human history. Creating communities of people who love, pray for, and support each other, all while solely being connected by the internet. So given that our previous definition of church is a gathering of people, can online church be considered real church? And the answer is yes. Is it different? Sure. Is it new? <laughs> Absolutely. Is it the way that all of us are going to want to experience fellowship and learning? Not necessarily, but we cannot rule it out as a way of doing church together. And Ultra Live strives to make online church as easy as possible for you and for your community. We would love to continue this conversation with you. To do so, head over to any one of our socials, our YouTube channel, or to alterlive.com. Thanks for watching.